Welcome back. Education News Now. The Kern High School District is preparing to open its 19th comprehensive high school. And that means, as it always does, several of the other 18 high schools will see their boundaries adjusted. It also means some students and parents are not going to be very happy. 17's Robert Price has more. You've heard the slogan, once a driller, always a driller. Well, in theory anyway, because every time the current high school district changes the maps to accommodate a new school, the same thing seems to happen. There's discussion about one little quirk of the boundary map. Well, kind of a big quirk, actually. Five middle class and upper middle class neighborhoods, Old Stockdale, Stockdale Estates, Amberton, Quailwood, and Laurel Glen, are in the Bakersfield High School enrollment area. Those neighborhoods form an odd appendage on the western side of BHS territory. Those students must pass near West High School, about two and a half miles away, to get to BHS, about four miles away. Now the proposed enrollment maps have not been released to the public, but a group of BHS parents has managed to get a look, and they say the three options they've seen move those five neighborhoods into the west enrollment area. This is Karina Chavez. The areas that they are trying to omit will be a detriment to Bakersfield High, its tradition, and its future. Yeah. Because those are the areas that invest for that glorious diversity to grow and be what it is. Here's Amanda Mazaros. Having gone there myself, having the rich history just in my personal family, knowing we're, he, my children are fourth generation VHS students, um, that is very important for our city, our town, our county, the high school district. We all know the rich history of VHS doesn't compare to any other high school in town. But Roger Sanchez, director of research and planning with the Kern High School District, says it's way too soon to say what might happen. I think our job is to make sure that we're being fair, uh, that we're looking at the data, that we're looking at the numbers, and that we're following the criteria that the board has established to make sure that, that we do um, you know, the equitable thing in, in, in the long run. The plan is to open new Del Oro High School by the fall of 2022 at the corner of Panama Lane and Cottonwood Road. The Kern High School District Board of Trustees will have to decide its new district-wide map by August of this year, at the latest. People, parents especially, get passionate when it comes to school alma maters, past, present, and future. And it looks like this one is no different. At West High School, Robert Price, 17 News. And still to come here on 17 News at 6, we will check back in with that plush-covered teddy bear on a 400-mile trek.